A girl like this may easily be noticed by bad guys. Beautiful body and sexy style. Moreover, going alone. Lastly, she looks easy to be cheated. The three guys thought of a way to lure the girl upstairs. They said they had a birthday party, but no one sang happy birthday song. So she was asked to sing. That was not reasonable. But the man knelt down to beg. The girl was persuaded and then agreed. It looked like she was being looked at by the vendors in the supermarket. Just following their orders. There's no way back. The man let her sit in the middle. The girl said she didn't drink alcohol. The three men immediately set up the act. Why do not soldiers drink alcohol? Don't be shy. The girl had to drink. All right, just a little. She drank a little. Then sang happy birthday song. At that moment, the man beside poured a shady liquid into the cup. But she didn't found out. Until she stood up. She lost consciousness. Three men revealed their true nature. She already came. It's too boring to just sing a song. They started to act. Pushed her to the bedroom. Next, something indescribable happened. Until the guys got bored. The girl was let go. The man gave her 15 dong. Also said, see you next time. But who wants to see him again? The girl threw the money on the road. And went home desperately. Seeing the niece crying on the ground. Grandpa quickly ran over to comfort. After knowing all. Grandfather immediately reported the police. The fighting Asians police is also very muscular. He broke the door, beat all. Just a few sayings. Could scared those bad guys to death. They were about to be taken to the station. Then the director suddenly appeared. He told them not to arrest. This case must be investigated for A.L. Ong time. It took a long time to know. Of these three guys. One person is the son of the director. The girl spent all day in the toilet washing her face with tears. Grandpa saw got pain in his heart. After a time, the girl was called to question. Questions are to change the truth wash away the charges of those three bad guys. The girl spoke out details at that time. The shameless opponent showed a series of magic logic. Said the girl targeted one of the three. Wanted to take over his body and house. Then all knew what happened. Turn innocent people into criminals. That logic. If not writing novels that is a waste of talent. But the helpless thing is. The scene does not have any evidence. Everything is the girl's narrative. So finding the truth is very difficult. Handling the culprit is more difficult. Three guys did not receive any punishment. They still appeared on the street. The grandfather got angrier. He used to make glorious victories. But he couldn't get justice for his niece. He wore all the medals of victory to the court. Including the Red Star Medal First Level National Defense Medal. Also the medal of the Gunner Voroshilov. These represent his level of shooting up to a certain standard. Grandpa hoped others would respect his merits. Then punish the three men. How birth brutal reality slapped him in the face. The opponent was like colluding with the sheriff. Not enough evidence. Even if he was an old soldier it was the same. Grandfather stood upset. Go to hell all of you. The girl was raped. But one of the guys got special help. So it's unable to investigate the case. Grandfather said. If justice and righteousness can't work. Let bad guys treat bad guys. Even if they can't afford it. They had to find a way. Grandpa sold a house. And got 5,000 United States dollars. Greater than after going home. The girl told him. The sheriff arrived. Also gave some money. He wanted to keep the case closed. Grandfather is extremely angry. He came to the sheriff with money. We don't need your money. Looking at the old man, the sheriff really didn't know if he's righteous or stupid. The girl's aunt lived not far away. Recently she wanted to travel for three weeks. Let the girl keep the key. Grandfather took the key to the aunt's house. Discovered the window in aunt's house. Facing the room of those three men. He got a plan. And prepared to punish them. The girl did not know what the grandfather was up to. She just saw. Grandpa left the house with a hoe and shovel. Busy people covered the train station. It's the place to get information. He was going to buy a gun. The battlefield gun. Not a pistol. Toy gun shop heard that. Thinking this old man watched too much movie. Grandfather found a villain in the market. Clearly stated his request. 
The villain also agreed with him. Then found him a good gun. Grandpa shot three times immediately. The villain respected. Those three shots. This old man is not simple. He must have been through training. That day mother came. But she did not come to comfort her daughter. But she heard that my grandfather sold the house. She wanted some money from him. Grandfather immediately said. Where you came from? Go back there. The bad guys often gathered on Wednesday. Grandpa planned for a while. Tomorrow is a good day for revenge. At night, he took out the gun hidden in the ant's house first. That day, Grandfather came under a tree to watch the people playing chess. Those three guys drove there. It's time. Everyone was focusing on the chess. No one noticed that Grandfather was slowly leaving. The guys were playing something. They didn't know. At that moment, greater than Grandpa was pointing gun at them. Who first? A high-level sniper clearly has the most skillful path of revenge. It may not kill you, but would make you live in pain. He targeted the wine bottle. A loud sound. The two beside were scared. How could the bottle explode? A professional killer. Grandpa was very calm. He picked up bullet. He went back to the chess game. And joined the game. Like he hadn't gone. The ambulance arrived attracting everyone's attention. When they knew the victim, no one felt regret for him. The old men even joked. Looking at the ambulance. Another Wednesday came. The second guy's turn. He got on the car, indulged in music. Grandpa aimed at the gas container. Pulled the trigger. A loud sound. Attracting neighbors. A bunch of people couldn't help but laugh. Those bad guys in turn got into trouble. Could this be the retribution in legend? There was only one young policeman who was wrong. Obviously, not a coincidence, police chief surmised. Definitely the girl's grandfather did it. No one else. He warned his son. Your two friends were harmed. You should be careful. You may be the next. The son was scared. He worried. And panicked. He moved a tree. And closed the curtain. The young policeman came to the house. To see if grandpa had weapons or not. But after a search, he found nothing. Until the girl said. Her aunt went traveling. She kept the key. He came up with something. Seeing the son in danger, the sheriff got serious. He told the son not to go anywhere. And went to investigate. They came to the aunt's house. The director was looking in the opposite direction. This place is indeed a good place to shoot. Just find a weapon. 0.4 S. Greater than there is evidence to arrest grandfather. Grandfather hid the gun in the wardrobe. But when the sheriff opened the wardrobe. It's empty. Even the grandfather was extremely surprised. Helplessly. The chief just let go of a threat. If my son gets trouble. I'll question you. But grandpa said. You son are already in trouble. Going to the son's house. The sheriff opened the door. The son thought the grandpa came to take revenge. So he shot once. And it hit the sheriff. He was also scared to death. They too caused this. And killed each other. After all. The grandpa was asked. He didn't do anything. How could he know the son was in trouble? He revealed. Since he committed the crime. He must have a feeling of guilt. After getting downstairs. Grandpa met the young police. Then he knew. The gun was hidden by that policeman. So it wasn't caught. He asked grandpa. Is it worth? Grandpa said. Life must be paid with life. That's how life is. The policeman didn't intend to catch grandpa. He said. You're free. But what freedom is? Back to home. His niece was singing. It's not the sound of joy. It seems miserable. The fight ended. Everyone thinks they are free. But for justice for the niece. Grandfather once again took the weapon. The victory does not represent the liberation of the people. When. Ordinary people do not need to carry weapons to fight by themselves. This is what is called true freedom.